Hi, everyone. It's Lynn from the Stitch TV Show. Um, listen, Happy New Year, everybody. I'm so glad you're joining us. It's going to be a great year with the Stitch. So we just wanted to keep giving you tips and stuff on Tuesdays. So here's my tip. Um, I do a lot of hand sewing and stuff like that. So one of the things that you need to know how to do is how to tie a knot. So here is my thread and my needle. And see, this is the eye of the needle, and this is the the point of the needle. It's probably called something a fish on. I just don't remember. Um, so what you want to do is you want to hold your needle by the eye of the needle with the thread. And then you are going to take the end of the thread that you want to have a knot with. Right? So, and I'm going to line that up even with the eye of my needle and I'm going to hold it. Okay? Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to wrap and I wrap away from me. I don't know that it matters, but I wrap away from me three times and you'll notice there's a little stitch. I'm trying to make sure you can see this. There's a little stitch that you can see there and I just scoot it back to where I can pinch it. Okay, now that I've kind of got it in between my fingers here, I'm just going to pull really slightly pull and I'm just holding on to that pinch which is where my wrap is and then as I pull that through you can see it created a knot there it is and that's how I make knots at the end of my um, thread and the, and it's a good solid knot I think you can make them bigger if you wrap it more than three times I think my just habit is three times so that works for me but that's how you do it there you go. And you don't have to spit on your fingers. Th that's a valid way to do it. And a lot of people do it that way, but I just don't. So anyway, happy new year. And thanks for joining us with the stitch. And we will talk to you soon.